Hi there, this video will show you how to import references from ScienceDirect into EntNote. I'll also show you how to create a folder within EntNote while importing references so that all the articles on the same topic are organized together. The video assumes that you have registered for a Web of Science and EntNote account and that you are able to log into the library's databases and navigate to ScienceDirect on your own. Before we start searching in ScienceDirect, we need to make sure that we are already signed into the Web of Science. Um, I'm signed in as the library, and um, if you sign in, your username should appear in this corner. And once you are signed into Web of Science, uh, click on EndNote. This will open the EndNote page. And once that's open, we can start I'm going to search for social companion robots. And let's just go back and now our um, our um, end notes page is open so now um, I can actually start exporting um, references from science direct to end notes so I'm just going to choose the first one here and to export just one citation or one reference I am going to go to export and I am going to export citation to RIS. Notice a file just got dropped into my download folder and from here I'm going to go to EndNote and under my references uh, actually under collects I'm going to click import references and this allows me to choose the file that um, I need to that I need to import. So it's automatically in my download folder. It's going to be the newest one that I just downloaded and click choose. In import option, we need to select the database. And so here I'm going to select Science Direct. And so Science Direct is here. Click on that. And under two, I am going to actually create a new group because I'm going to start searching for articles on social companion robot. I'm just going to call it social robot for now and click OK. So now one record has been imported. If I go to my references, here I see under my groups, there is now a new group, Social Robots. If I click on that, there is one article. Now I'm going to go back to Science Direct and I'm just going to go back to my results list and get more article more articles now i am actually going to um, select more articles and download multiple or import multiple articles into my end note so i have selected four or five um, and the the procedure the steps are the same so once i've selected enough um, or as many as i need i am going to go up to export and i'm going to export citation to ris again and this ris file format allows different um, citation management programs such as zotero or endnote to share file so now i'm going to go back to my end note and under collect click import references there is my um, import re references folder again so i'm under file i'm going to choose the newest one uh, so it should be this one um down. so choose and um, again i need to select i need to choose science direct and it's this one and here i can um, i can choose under two i'll choose social robots import and so now five references have been imported so if i go to my references and look under my group um, social robots and i have now i have 
six articles. Okay, and like before, if we want to get to the full text, um, we can just click on the full text finder icon here and log in on the top of the screen. And this should allow you to navigate to the full text article. And I can download the PDF here. Thank you for watching this video. I hope this helps for now. Please feel free to contact the library if you need more assistance.